Right, I'm in a hurry this morning, so the quickest intro ever. You are sick of me talking about my electric car, saying I hate my electric car, it's terrible, I don't like electric cars, EVs are rubbish, I'm shocked about my electric car, you're sick of it, I'm sick of it, I can't get rid of it, we know electric cars are rubbish. So, I've done something about it, and I'm going to get into that in a minute, but I've got to go and get my hair cut, and there's a reason for it. And if you don't like electric cars, don't worry, because I've got some exciting news for you. I'm super excited, and you know I don't say that. Well, actually, I've started saying that a lot, haven't I? Anyway, if you to the channel, hit the subscribe button, click the little bell for notifications of when I upload new videos. Now, without further ado, my friends, let's go. I'm late, I've got to get my car. Get, get out, <laughs> bloody thing. Hang on, keys. When you're charging your car, your, lock charge, your charger locks into your car so that people can't steal the uh, the wire from it, etc. Come on, out. There we go. Right, pop this back. Stay with me, don't go anywhere. Exciting news, exciting news. Right, one, two, three. Get in there. Get in there. That's it. Onwards. Come on, I'm in a hurry. Get in the car. Oh. Right. Come on, let's get on the road. Exciting news. Yes. Come on. Onwards, my friends. Right, interesting that by the way, just gone past a Peugeot garage there and it says electric available from 2p per mile. Now, I worked in advertising, gonna tell you the magic word there, right? Okay, the magic word there is from, from 2p per mile, from, right? Remember that, from, it's a little word, but it actually has a big meaning. So from 2p per mile, it won't cost you 2p per mile because the car will cost you more to start with and then uh, you'll have to end up replacing the battery which will cost you an absolute arm and a leg. In fact, you'll just have to throw the car away, pretty much like you do with a mobile phone. Anyway, this is not really uh, this is about electric cars, this video. Well, it kind of is, but it isn't. But I'm sick of banging on and bleating on about my electric car. I'm sick of the likes of Morag who follows me all the time and she's on and on and banging on about electric cars and she says she doesn't work for the government but I mean if she doesn't work for the government then blimey she's got a lot of time on her hands. Actually you have got a lot of time on your hands if you've got an electric car because you've got nothing else better to do while you're charging. In fact if you own an electric car you must be a really boring person and not value your time because you just sit there for ages whiling away while it's charging and then they'll go well i think you'll find it charges while i'm in bed what a load of cobs wallop yeah if you have a life you go out and about and you charge your car while you're out and about and you end up having to charge it on public charges and it takes ages so i'm sick of it i'm sick of talking about electric cars i'm sick of people trying to shove electric cars down our throat i tell you what don't shove them down our throat shove them up your arsenal and spurs fighting not just today for the pride of their manor Blidworth. This is Blidworth in Nottinghamshire. Interesting. Well, it, it isn't really, is it? I mean, it's not that interesting, but I used to live here uh, because my ex-wife, Sharon, was from here. And I met her and uh, we lived in uh, an old uh, pit house there. 
that was, I think it was housing association at the time, many years ago, and then we ended up buying it, etc., and doing it up, and we're, it, it was good times. It's where Paige grew up in, uh, for, for a younger part of her life, when she was younger. That's my eldest daughter, Paige. Anyway, as I say, I'm sick of my electric car, and you're probably sick of me talking about my electric car, because this channel isn't just about electric cars, it's about travel, food and tech. You get people in the comment section going, boring, boring, sick of listening to you about your electric car, boring, boring, oh, no, the battery, shut up about your electric car. Some of them are probably people that love electric cars and try and stop me talking about it because I'm having an effect on stopping people from buying electric cars. And if you are thinking of buying an electric car, don't because they are terrible. It'll take you ever to get them fully charged. So you'll never get it fully charged. In fact, you can't have it fully charged because you're only supposed to charge up to 80%. Anyway, well, let's get to the point here, right? This channel isn't just about electric cars, and I like to please everybody, but there is a famous saying, is it by John Litgate? You can let me know in the comment section down below. You can please some people all of the time. You can please all of the people some of the time, but you can't please all of the people all of the time. And no, I can't. I also do travel videos and flight videos and flying off abroad, etc. And them are the videos that I love to do. But I'm doing the electric car videos because I feel I have to educate people into the fact that electric cars aren't the future. But still, I want to not leave the other people out who subscribe to the channel, put my teeth back in, for the travel videos. So I've got some exciting news for you. Exciting, super exciting. That's boring. You're boring everybody. Quit boring everyone. Right, okay. Oh, okay, electric cars are very fast, by the way, incredibly fast. In fact, the new Porsche Taycan is 0 to 60. Don't quote me on this, by the way. I'm probably like 0.0.0.1 of a second out or something. But I think it's 0 to 60 in 2.1 seconds. It's ridiculous because obviously, when people bought the first generation Porsche Taycan, they all said, oh, I think it should be a little bit faster, said no one ever. Maybe they've said, I think it should have like 700 miles of range instead of 0 to 60 in 2.1 seconds, which nobody can do on these roads anyway. But anyway, we're bleating on about that. So I want to do other things, not just electric car videos. I'm bleating on about electric cars all the time. However, I will continue my mission to destroy the EV agenda. <laughs> So if you are watching Morag, if you are watching Evangelists, I'm coming for you. And the more you push me into saying, stop going on about electric cars, they are the future, the more I will push back. I will not stop my mission until I have put an end to this stupidity of electric cars. If you buy an electric car, then you're a bit of a smeghead. See what I did there? Oh, let's get past this van. Whoa! There we go. There you go. You can do things like that when you've got an electric car. You can get past them really quickly. Right, do you know what? I love this time of year. Cherry blossom is out. This is my favourite time of year. Spring. It's when everything comes back to life again. Everything's flowering. Everything's in bloom. I love it. We just need a little bit of sunshine. In fact, there is no sunshine but I'm gonna do something about it. I'm gonna bring some sunshine into your life. So if you're not subscribed, by the way, just make sure you hit the subscribe button. It doesn't cost you a penny. And I'm gonna take you with me on a little journey. It's gonna be a good one. Of course, there's a speed camera ahead. I know they're all over the place.
So, I'm going to put you out of your misery soon, don't worry. Hey, I know what you're thinking there. Now listen, I've booked a flight to go somewhere and I'm going to meet somebody as well. I'm really excited because I'm going to get on a plane, I'm going to film the journey there, I'm going to film loads while I'm there because I'm going somewhere for 10 days of filming and I'm going to try and get two or three videos filmed a day if I can, edit them, upload them, bring you lots of sunshine and also somebody's going to help me because they're going to be waiting for me. Uh, well, not at the airport, but they'll be they'll be over there because they live over there. So I'm off somewhere and I'm going to go and meet somebody and they're going to take me around the island. It is an island, isn't it? I think it is an island. Yeah, it's an island. I'm pretty sure it's an island. It's an island. I'm re I'm, I'm excited. I'm really excited. <laughs> Bet they don't have many electric cars on there. Give it a thumbs up now, this video, because I tell you what, you have no idea how many times I have to get out of the car, go back in, walk back, go there, be to set all these camera shots up, shots, shot, shot, shots up. I haven't got a cameraman, you know. Sorry, camera person, you can't say that these days, can you? Like a bit like a manhole cover. It's not called a manhole cover anymore. It's called something else. I don't know what it is. In fact, I think they're even changing the name of Mansfield now to Persons Field. The world's gone mad. Why do people do that, eh? You know what, why do people do that? They should look after the places that they're living in. Right, Baz the Barber. Baz the Barber. Can we fix it? Katie's in as well. Katie's in as well. There's Dave in there. Dave's there. Dave's here as well. Baz the Barber's there, look. Look at Dave, he's looking all trendy. Isn't Dave looking trendy? Let's get in here. Hello, Lee. The barber. Let me change my. There we go. What? Far away. <laughs> <Get away. laughs> Can you fix it, Baz? The barber. <laughs> fix your ear. <laughs> fix your ear. Can you fix my hair? Yeah, that's all. You're looking a bit tired, Baz. <laughs> I am tired. I had a late night last night, Eel, and I'm back early this morning. You're a worker. I know. And I've Who, got kids. I've got to ask you a question. Mm. Who cuts your hair? Random people. <laughs> Random people. <laughs> then I have to come here and sort it out. Can they cut hours? <laughs> you're, looking, you're looking very trendy, you are. Isn't it? Aren't you? Isn't it? You're looking very trendy, you are. I was going to wear blue and yellow, but I haven't got blue and yellow. I'll tell you what. Separated at birth. Are you sick of me talking about my electric car? To the back teeth. Sick of me. Sick of you, yeah. Where's my coffee, Buzz? You were late, an hour. I'm not late, he said half past eight. You told me half past seven. I know, but then he changed it and I forgot to tell you. I forgot to tell you. I'm going away. Where are you going? I'm going away. Can you say, are these yours here? Yeah. Right. Can you say? Can I say? Can you say? I'm I'm 61 years of age, I hope I can. You don't look 61. I know, but I'm You look great. Actually, I'm available. I like beard. It's all right, isn't it? Yeah, you look great, don't you? Don't only talk like one, I look like one. Yeah, go on then. You look fantastic. So, you watch my videos, don't you? Unfortunately, yeah. Uh, are you fed up with the electric car ones for now? Honestly? Yeah. I bloody am. Yeah. <laughs> I'm an ice man. Right, can you say the wall are? The wall are? Wall are? Wall, I was down there yesterday. The wall are? In Majorca. In Majorca. Don't taste like? Don't taste like? What it all are? What it all are? The water in Majorca don't taste like what it ought to. Remember that advert? Is that from Luton Airport? No, it was a. Uh, I think it was Carlsberg or Heineken or something, uh, wasn't it, on the TV? I'm going. You know. You're not. You know. I am going to take these guys with me. You're not going to kill it, kill it like you killed Pathos, then? No, <laughs> probably not. No, because I tell you what, while I'm there, 
I'm meeting a lady called Alex from Mallorca under the sun. Is it Mallorca or Mallorca? Mallorca. 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 Is it Mallorca? Is it Mallorca or Mallorca? I'm meeting Alex. Mallorca. Oh, Skegnesty. So we're off to Mallorca. Is it Mallorca or Mallorca or Mallorca? There's Mallorca and Minorca in there, or Monorca. Mallorca. Down below. Mallorca. Mallorca, 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 Mallorca. Mallorca. I'll ask Alex what it is. Because yeah. I'm going to see Alex from Mallorca under the sun. And while I have my hair cut, right? Mm -hmm. In fact, I'm going to get in the chair first. You can actually film it. Don't go anywhere yet because I've got a message from Alex over in Mallorca because we've got loads to do. She's given me a list of stuff and I'm going to read, 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 read it to you in a minute. I need to get my hair cut anyway. Uh, don't go anywhere. Now I'll take over two seconds. What are you talking about? It's getting a bit thin, you'll thin it. Can't take him anywhere. Dump pond on top. <laughs> <laughs> what would you mind us off? Open all hours. Open all hours? Hang on, hang oh, on, which one am I? <laughs> which one am I? <laughs> Can you stutter? Can you get a gramville? No. Gladys Emmanuel, that's me. Just keep cutting here, Nurse Gladys. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Baz. You're welcome, Lee. No advertising, but I'm at Baseford Barber Shop in Nottingham. The best barbers in the world. Don't look at my haircut though. I'm probably not the best advertisement for this barber shop as I have it cut a little bit silly. But there we go. Anyway, let's get in the chair. And let's get my Mallorca, Majorca, Mallorca, you, you know what I mean. Let's get my haircut. Mallorca. 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 Majorca. Right. This is where the magic happens. <laughs> can you fix? Can you fix it? That's, that's in the other room. Lee. I want my. That's in the other room. <laughs> this the special room. It's nice pink. Haircut for the holiday for Majorca, Majorca, Mallorca, Majorca. One of them. When are you going? I'm going. I'm going uh, in a couple of days, and I'm taking these guys with us. Oh, yeah. I'm taking them with us. Oh, man. That's yeah. a big suitcase. It is a bit. No, yeah. I never. I never have a big suitcase. <laughs> so no more electric cars for a couple of well, ten days, yeah. maybe a couple of weeks, with all the videos that I do. So can you make me look more handsome? No, no, no. You can't. No. Too handsome. See you in a bit. I tell you what. While I'm having my hair cut, right? Uh, Alex from New York under the sun, who I'm going to be doing lots of videos with has sent me a little video message. So you have a look at uh, and listen to that, right? Because she's got some exciting stuff to tell you. And then I'll come back to you in a minute when he's done my hair. See you in a minute. Here's, here's Alex, over to Alex. Now, many of you are going to know the wonderful holiday island of Mallorca better than you know me, but my name is Alex and I run the Mallorca Under the Sun YouTube channel and I am so excited to say that I'm going to be filming with the MacMaster all next week and I'm going to be showing him around the island. Now, my channel is full of holiday guides, travel tips and holiday news to help you with your holiday, so I'm going to be helping Lee with his holiday and we're going to be visiting Magaluf, we're going to be visiting Santa Ponza and of course the very lovely Palma Nova which you can see behind me. We're also going to head up to the northeast as well, we're going to go to Alcudia, we might head down the south coast, we'll be visiting the capital city Palma and I may even take him to a couple of hilltop towns too, we shall see. Now as you all know Lee really likes his English food, he likes his English breakfasts, he likes his Sunday roasts. Would you like him also to try some of the local foods as well? Should I be taking him for tapas or a paella? Let me know. Okay, everyone, I can't wait to get filming when he gets over to the island, so make sure you follow us for these videos. It's going to be a great week. It's going to be a fun week ahead, and I look forward to seeing you on his next video. Goodbye for now. Right, come on in, Dave. Come on in. We don't want to leave you out, do we? Right. Now then, what do you reckon to my haircut? What do I look like? What do I look like, eh? Complete cockwomble. A cockwomble. <laughs> right, well, anyway, I'm going to Mallorca. 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 Uh, and Alex there has told you basically what, what, what we're going to do. She's got lots of stuff. Guess where I'm stopping? Go on. Guess where I'm stopping? Magaluf. Oh, no. Magaluf. Yeah. Do you know what they call it? We all know what they call it, don't we? Hey, what do they call it? You want me to say all the bad stuff, don't you? Um... 
It's, we, you know what they could be. Jagalove. <laughs> it's not that, it's something else. Oh, right. Yeah, it's, anyway. Right, so, we've got a um, a thing here. There'll be none of that anyway. And it's no, changed no. now. Magaluf's changed. Has it? Yeah, Magaluf changed. I think we're both in there. Let me move that back So it's all bit. brass rubbing and Chianti, is it? No, do you know what? Um, Alex was telling me, because I went, oh, I don't know about stopping in Magaluf. And she went, oh, no, it's changed now. Uh, in all the all-inclusive bars there, apparently, uh, Alex will tell you, right? But you can only, you're limited to two drinks in uh uh, in uh, in your all you can eat stuff and you're all inclusive go away no no it's changed there's no partying there's no fun anymore no. there it's all good they've tried to make it a bit more upmarket well, now i think 1830s ceased as well hasn't it now that don't happen well i, I won't be going to club 1830 anyway well, you're old enough but anyway she's given me a list of stuff here she says magaluf go straight to uh, black beards for food when you arrive it's on the beach five minutes walk from the hotel you absolutely can't say anything bad about this place Best ribs and burgers in Mallorca, amazing steaks. This is going to be a great series. Um, not expensive either. Uh, it's amazing. I know one of the owners. So go to Tom Brown's, just renovated for breakfast or happy house further down the road. Uh, also got uh, Magaluf Strip, gets more views than the beach. Sounds so, good. Yeah, that's good. Uh, and uh, we've got another one here, Palmer Nova. Oh, uh, right, so we're going to get an Oasis album. Palmer Nova. I don't know, I've no idea. Uh, lots of Brit food places as well. I think you're... Why, why are you eating English food when you're going away? You should get down with the Spanish and eat that. Uh, Spanish food is... I don't want to eat Spanish why? food. What's wrong with Spanish food? It's leftover christening yeah. food, isn't it? Santa Ponza we've got there. Santa Ponza. Uh, we've got uh, Mrs Murphy's Kitchen serves traditional Irish food like roasts. So we're going to be having full English breakfast, fish and chips, you, meat pie. You might be able to get an Ulster Fry. An Ulster Fry, there. yeah, we're going to be doing all that. We don't want none of that christening food. So, uh -huh. Phil and Janice, give it a break, all right? Uh, Son, Son Caliou, uh, Son, Son Caliou, uh, located to, next to Palmer Nova. We've got Alcudia, very uh, popular. Yeah, that's going to be good. I went it? to yeah. Alcudia in my day, I did. Puerto Palenza, uh, we're going there. Uh, we've got Mur Muro Beach, Can Pick a Fort. Uh, then we've no, got Can Pick a Fight. Can Pick a Fight. Calador. I've been there. Went there with yeah, Sarah. I've been Calador. I went to Calador with Sarah before Harriet. That was a long time ago. Uh, East Coast, uh, Sacoma. So we're going there. Plus Palmer, the capital uh, city as well. How long are we going for? I'm, I'm going 10 days filming and I'm going to film every day. I'm going to work seven days a week, 18 hours a day filming and editing. Uh, we're going to the northwest as well and Alex is going to show me around all the different places from Mallorca under the sun. Mallorca, Mallorca, Major tell me in the comments that I'm confused. Can you please learn what it's called before you go? Mallorca, Mallorca, Majorca. I don't know, I, I don't know. Do you know what worries me though more, by the way, is the fact that now when I have my hair cut with Baz, he says, do you want me to trim your eyebrows and your ears? And that's, you know, when you're getting old, don't you? Mm, well, yeah, that. No, unfortunately. So I'm sick of doing all the electric car videos, right? right? I've had enough of it at the moment. I will be back doing electric car videos, whinging about them, because I've got to, what do you think of electric cars? Oh, no, you know my view on electric cars. No, not for me. Won't have one, never. Don't even think about getting me one. Will they be the future? Well, I won't be here if they are, because it's absolutely rubbish. Can you imagine an electric ambulance? Oh, they're doing them. They're doing them. Yeah. Uh, no. Will my wife wait? Will my wife make it? Well, we don't know because we've got to find a charging point. Anyway, <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this little video. It's a surprise. We're going to Mallorca, Mallorca, Mallorca. We're going, uh, yeah, Spain basically. Spain. And it's an island, isn't it? Oh, but you have to pay a tax, don't you, on Mallorca for tourist tax? You do have to pay a tourist tax, yeah? Yeah, yeah that's a, it's a bit They'll charge a, you double. It says on the thing at the hotel you have to pay a, a, a four euros a day or something, I think it is. So we're going up market now, aren't we? Mallorca, Australia. Tell you, you can tell Cyprus, you're hanging don't around. Don't forget with. Cyprus. So, well, yeah, well, we'll, best, we'll, we'll, we'll go back to that later Listen, on. listen yeah, about that yeah, one better. Yeah. Um, so there we go. We're travelling again. I'm going to take you guys with us. We're going from East Midlands Airport. I'm going to get the flight over there. I'm going to get in flight. I'm going to get takeoff landing. We're going with Jet 2, so they've got Yorkshire tea. Uh, and, I'm, and I'm even going to stop at a hotel, I think, at East Midlands the night before. I think I might do that. Pushing the boat out. I'm going to push boat out. Anyway, that's uh, all from me today. Thanks, Dave. Can I, can I take you for breakfast?
I will go to breakfast with you, yeah, but you can't take me for it because I pay my own way. No, I, I, it's my treat. Oh. It's my treat. I will treat McDonald's you. McDonald's breakfast wrap then. It, it's easy, weather spoons. Anyway, on that bombshell, make sure you hit the subscribe button. I feel a bit hyper today. You, don't, I don't know what's up with you. I, said, I thought when you have your hair cut, you lose all your strength. Do you know what it is? Go on. I'm fully charged. Oh. <laughs> he hasn't got range flipping anxiety. That's what it is. I haven't. And on that bombshell, we'll see you in the next one. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Click the little bell for notifications of when I upload new videos. It's free, so subscribe.